Hello, 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 hello. How's it going? Finally got the stream up and running. We'll see how it turns out. We will be doing Valgero. Haven't been on this map in like two years. So I'm thinking we'll probably go to the Chalk Hills to start off with. Just because I haven't played up there very much. And it's kind of where like the specific creatures are. You know, the little feather raptors and stuff like that. So we'll go ahead and I'll probably spawn in at... Zone 1. I think that's closer to like the water. Or at least a cliff area. Right up in here. And I am using my other character. The one that I've been using from all my other playthroughs. So at least we'll have all of our Ingrams and all that kind of stuff. Alright, let's get everything sorted out. Make sure nothing's trying to eat us right away. It's usually the way it happens, though. And, of course, there's some raptors right there. Fantastic. So you guys have to let me know how the audio sounds and everything whenever we get going a little bit. Make sure everybody can hear. You can hear the game and all that good stuff. Let's go ahead and get... Oh, man, we got all this junk in here. Forgot to turn all that off. So many skins. I'll keep the hat. I do like the hat, and I like the axe skin. All the other ones, ah, we don't really need them. So, speaking of an axe, let's go ahead. Need to get a little bit of stone. We can find one. That's the only thing about Valgaro is most of this stuff. up oh, there's some stone right there. Let's say most of the stone you can't actually do anything with. All right, let's get a little bit of flint. Be able to get us our axe. And I'd like to get somewhere built today. Somewhere safe, maybe up, kind of out of the area a little bit, maybe over there. That's an Allosaur jumping off. Fantastic. Like to see it. I think we can put this on our stone one too, right? Let's get rid of that. Yes, we can. Hey, Croc, how's it going, man? Yeah, I finally got the stream going. Took a little bit. I know a lot of people have been asking about live streams and stuff like that. And it's a little bit different than recording. I'll definitely say that. A <laughs> different way of setting everything up. Yeah, I know, right? Yeah, that's, that's the problem with uh, <laughs> always running up and smacking dinos a little bit, you know? Let's grab a little bit more stuff here. I want to get out towards the cliff a little bit. We'll get some... A little bit of clothes made, stuff like that. And then try to get... Usually try to get something small. There should be some little Jerboas up around here. Hopefully. Yeah, I know it's a lot of bad stuff up over here. It's... I usually start off on the islands that are floating over there. But I figure... I try something a little bit different. Like I said, I'm not over here very often. Let's make up... I think five will be fine. That should be good enough for right now, at least. I'm surprised some of those uh, little feather raptors aren't around. How long can I survive for? I don't know. That's a thing. It all depends on <laughs> how the dino spawns are with the raptors and stuff. I'm guessing maybe a little bit. I usually die a couple times until I get a base set up, which is what I'm kind of worried about because... Of the respawn. Our respawn will be way over there. Let's try to find some little Jerboas. I want to do two things with them. I want to tame one and I want to kill one. As soon as we can get the Jerboas, we can get some get some hide, make some bolas, and then get a Parasaur or two. And then we'll be set on like hide and stuff, you know? Yeah, see, I've never seen the unicorn. I only saw one at the end of my very first playthrough on this map, and it was way over there in the other side of the map. And it was actually on the last day I was on this map before I left. That's the only unicorn I've ever seen in Ark, period. Can we get a bow and arrow going? We can. 22, that'll be good enough for right now. It's a little bit better than the spear, I think. 
Yeah, that's kind of one reason I, I wanted to spawn over here is because they're in this area. I'd like to get one of those somewhat for our first teams, and I don't know if you can see it, there's some actually right over there. Oh, dude. Yeah, at least there's a little bit of stuff in between us and them. Let's go ahead and get the bow down here. Nice, nice. I feel a little bit better. Not much, but a little bit. Really need to get some hide. I'm surprised we haven't seen any Jerboas. I thought they were all over the flat area up here. Yeah, if we could find a unicorn, that would be fantastic. Uh, don't you need carrots, though, for taming them? I don't know. All, all I ever did was that one, and I had a farm and everything going for then. Sorry, dude. I need your hide, man. Sacrifice. Oh, it's a level 132. Couldn't be a low level one, you know? Yeah, and they got a nice kick for knocking stuff out, too. I believe, don't they? Alright, let's try to get some bolas going, just in case we get into a bad situation. One. Well, that's... <laughs> I mean, uh, it'll work, right? Oh, we just need fiber. Yeah, we can get plenty of that around here. Actually, some bushes right here. I do have it set to where the days are really long, so we won't have to worry about nighttime too much. Usually on my playthroughs, I skip the nighttime, and it's just better for recording and stuff, so... It'll be a little bit different, you know? Let's get another bowler or two made. Let's move this around a little bit. There we go. Easier to access everything. Oh, sorry about that. I gotta adjust my settings. Sorry for the timeout. I think it just did that for... For, uh, chatting too much. I'll have to adjust that. Sorry about that, man. Like I said, this whole, whole streaming thing is a lot different compared to... to recording. Alright, let's try to get some pants. Try to get a little bit of clothes going. Life, life's not too bad. <laughs> Life will be a lot better in-game, though, if we can make it through without dying. And I need to make a hat. Alright, so we're somewhat getting sorted out. What are we missing? Just some feet. A little bit of fiber. What's up, buddy? Yep. Ah, uh, don't kick me. So, where do we want to do base at? I mean, I'd like to do it by a water source, so we can either do it up here, or down below, or we can try back over where we spawned, but there was a lot of raptors over that way. Yeah, that's why I was wanting to get this first stream done and out of the way, that way I can kind of figure out everything I need to change up on it. Let's get a little bit more flint. We'll get a torch, throw our skin on that, clean our inventory up. Alright. And then we also need to figure out what we want to try to do for our first team coming up. Oh, that won't kick you? It's the last thing I need. Die by a horse. <laughs> Alright, so that drops down to the other area. I want to be near the Redwoods, but not in them. I mean, Thylas are a thing. Favorite mount, but they are quite deadly. Tell you what, let's head over... I thought there was another water source over here. That's why I was coming this way, too. Oh, dude. Well, while we're here... There we 
There we go. Get us a little Jerboa. I forgot that they're not a passive team. But it shouldn't take them too long to tame up. Maybe one or two berries, if that. Poor little dude. Look at him already napping, man. We've only been here for a few minutes, and he's already got to take a break. Yeah, that was the thing about taming, I think even the unicorn was, it's really weird with the the mechanic versus everything else. How they try to buck you off whenever you're you're trying to tame them. It's kind of neat though, I'm glad stuff's a little bit different for taming, that way it's not all the same. Oh, dude, it's hoping to have a place by water by now. I gotta quit running all over the place. We'll grab some berries. Should last for a few minutes. As long as I'm not running. Dude, do not start pushing me around, man. Yeah, I know how you are. Dude, I did not realize those things are so fast. I tamed one on, was it Genesis 2, I think? Hey, how's it going? And, uh... Oh, dude, yep, raptors. As long as it's just one, we're alright. But yeah, whenever I was on Genesis 2 and Tamed 1, those things move so fast, man. I think we'll just head down here towards the water. Get a little camp set up on the beach. Oh, it's a Feather Raptors. Forget how you pronounce their name. That's alright. Come over here, man. Yep. You stay there. And I'll go this way. Nice. Another raptor. <laughs> we might be able to outrun them. I don't think so, though. Yep, gotcha. Alright, now we need the water for two things. One for drinking, two for swimming. Can we make it down that? I do got high health. We might be able to survive that fall. Let's just go down this way. Starting to think this is a bad choice. Yep, too far. Oh! Nope, we're good. We're good! Nailed it! Yeah, those tech wyverns, man. The void worms? Oh, dude, that thing was so hard to tame. Then they had that mechanic that's kind of like the... Kind of like the Reapers, you know? Alright, let's get our hide together. And start building us a base so we can at least have somewhere to respawn at. At least we don't have to worry about water and stuff right now, either. We'll grab some of the trees over here. And maybe build on those rocks right there? I think that'd be good. I just wanted to be near the chalk hills when we started out. Oh, I didn't know that about the Jurassic Park Raptors. Dude, that's the first thing I thought about when I started playing Ark back in the day was Jurassic Park. It's like, oh dude, it's like living the movie, you know? Well, not living, but you know what I mean. Dude, I lost our much chops on our playthrough we're doing. Over on the island? I don't know where he went to. So, he was on aggressive when we had the issue with the penguins. And disappeared. Haven't seen him. Yep, I see you though. Thieving little things. Uh, it usually collects them whenever I whenever I harvest, doesn't it? I know, man. It's like a dog eat dog world here. All right, let's start grabbing some stuff. We'll try to build us. Do you want to do wood or stone? Yeah, I, don't, I hate the pagos, man. Those things are so so annoying. Those and the seagulls. Oh, dude. Let's start off, I guess, with wood, right? One. Ah, a whole one. <laughs> okay, I didn't need quite a bit more. Oh, they do disappear? Okay, yeah, I'll try to remember to har- or to not harvest them, but grab them. Is this open, or is this a closed-in cove? Ah, it's open. That'll work. Let's do it right here. We can move later. 
Just need somewhere to set up shop, get some metal and stuff like that going. And what are we missing for more? We got a little bit of wood. Food's not really an issue. And thatch. Ah, oh, man. We're going to end up taking out all the trees around here. Ah, oh, the micro raptors, dude. I had so many problems with those over on Scorched Earth. I mean, they're a problem everywhere, but Scorched Earth in particular, because everywhere I went out to kind of like the sand dune desert area, always went through little micro raptor city area. And there was a bug or something after an update to where your all my teams were on passive flea, and I didn't know about it. And so every time I got knocked off, my saber kept running and just like leaving me there for bait. And it took probably like three videos, I think, for me to figure out what was going on with that. Dude, we're gonna have like a wood shortage area, or uh, wood shortage here in a few minutes. I'm thinking about taming some Trudons over on the island. Never mess with them. I mean, they've messed with me, but I've never messed with them, you know? Alright, so we can do... I want to do like a 2x2. Two two. So what are we missing? Wood. Ah, oh, dude. Take out the rest of these trees. I was trying to leave some of the trees around. Hey, Broken Skull. How's it going, man? Can I not? There we go. The good thing about bringing my character over is we'll be able to get all the drops and everything around here. Alright, can we make two more? We can. Nice. Tell you what, let me turn this bot off for a minute. Alright, we'll see if that kind of fixed the issue about getting timed out by stream elements. I don't know, all that stuff I had turned off, but it's like it's back on. The giant centipedes, are you talking about the sandworms? Because the sandworms are no joke. Unless there's another giant centipede that I'm not aware of, which is kind of terrifying. All right, so we should have just about a base done. The starting of one. So one, two, three, three more. What are we missing? Probably just wood. Still good on fiber. Let's head over this way. So we'll get this little bit of a base done, put down a bed, and then we'll look at trying to tame something. That way we got some transportation. Maybe I don't know, I kind of want to get a Parasaur just so we can go far away, use him as like a pack mule. Just until we get like an Argentavis or something. Oh, they're herbivores? <laughs> Alright, well, not an Ark, I can tell you that. Alright, yeah, we're about out of trees. Can I not hit you? There we go. So what was it? Two more, I think, on the walls? Not those. Dude, I wish I could unlearn that Ingram. Can't tell you how many times I've made that thinking it was something else. And there's a bed. And we'll do... 
Go ahead and do a big one. Let's grab a little bit of water while we're right here, and nothing's trying to eat us. So what do I need to tame those with? I always just use vegetables. I mean, I know there's some, we just gotta have to build like a little canoe. Let's do that, we'll build a canoe. We can still build that, right? Yeah, we'll do that. We'll build the canoe, because I think it's... Which side of the map are we on? Yeah, right over there should be that little vegetable patch. Grab some carrots from there. Any more trees? Way up there? One over here? Let's go this way. Yeah, we'll do the horse. Like I said, I've never tamed one off the start, so it'll be it'll be nice to do something different. And I'm short one wall. Need wood. All right, throw a bed out, and I will feel better about that. Let's do it this way. Nice. Yeah, we'll grab some carrots. We'll build a canoe and go across the water right there. And grab them that way. Eat these berries before he starts hollering. Dude is always hungry, man. I tell you what. Don't need the stem berries right now. We will hold on to that. We'll go ahead and eat those. Cool. Well, it's definitely going better than I expected. Spawning over at this area. That's a cool thing about the islands in the middle is it's like nothing over there that's aggressive, you know? So how's the audio for you guys? Can you hear the game and everything all right? Nothing's too loud? All right, so there's the last wall. And I think we needed, I don't know which one we needed two of. And let's do four of these. And that'll take care of that. Let's grab a little bit more wood. I think we're going to need some for the canoe. And then we'll head over and try to grab that stuff. What time is it? Ah, getting towards the afternoon. We still got plenty of time, though, I think. I think those carrots, they spoil, like, really, really fast, don't they? Yeah, that'll 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 work out then because it always takes so long to get kind of like the trank arrows and everything made up right at the start. So the horse will definitely help out with that. All right, let's see if we can finish this up. We should have everything we need except for the the one slope piece. So that's a left. So we need a right. There we go. Nice. There we go. Feel a little bit safer. What are we missing for this? Thatch. Oh man, a whole bunch of thatch. Alright, so maybe we should start scouting out for a horse too. Tell you what, let's go let's go this way. I don't know if any are over on that island or not. I don't remember. Like I said, it's been a very, very long time since I've been on this map.
Dude just popped in out of nowhere. Oh man, there's Spinos back over here. Or used to be. If this is where that lake is at. Alright, that should be enough to build a canoe now. Yeah, there we go. That's probably one of the best additions for Genesis 2 that I think besides the the little egg incubator that they had. Dude, it makes it so easy instead of building like a big old raft. It's pretty good down like the little creeks and stuff and the smaller rivers. So we'll get up here, grab the carrots, try to find us one of the horse. And try to get them tamed. I think it's what? It's a passive tame, right? Oh, dude. Back up. Little thief. Holy crap, man. What level is he? Dude, seriously? Find your own wood. There we go. Uh-huh. How'd that work out for you? Was it worth it? Didn't think so. Snow biome, huh? Maybe we'll just take a we'll take a ride up there on the canoe. We can always ride it back. Oh wait, we need a saddle, don't we? Or is there, are they no saddle? I totally forgot we got the Jerboa up there. At least there's no sandstorms and stuff. It'd be a little bit different going down to that underwater cave, too. I think there's a way... Was it over on that side? Where it's got that little crack that goes straight down, and you don't have to go through that whole, like, tunnel and everything. Okay, so they don't need a saddle. Yeah, I thought they had one. I couldn't remember if it was required or not. I kind of like the teams where you don't need a saddle, like the wolves. I mean, I hate the wolves, but they're kind of nice because you don't have to make the saddles right away. Only thing that sucks is you don't get that armor bonus, you know? Nothing like a nice stroll on the lake. Oh, back where we were, over there. Yeah, and the snow biome's got quite a bit of bad stuff in it, I know. Last thing I want to do is die all the way over there. I mean, I wouldn't go back to get my stuff. We don't really have much, but... And I think... Is it over this way? Yeah, I think it's right there by those trees. Oh, that's kind of weird. What you got under here? Some eggs, okay. I see the dead dolphins are still a thing in this map. Sorry, buddy. Now let's go up right here. And hopefully avoid the wrecks that are usually over here. Uh, right now this is Valgaro. I think we'll be doing this one for the streams. Just because I have stuff going on on all the other maps. Dude, I thought that was a raptor, man. Thing is, what's he running from? Yeah, they're fighting something over here. Raptor, of course. And I got one bola left. I don't think I can make any more of them. What are we missing? Stones. Oh, we can get some stone. That's not a problem. Grab some right here. Yeah, right now, though, for our normal playthrough, we're over on the island, though. It's kind of neat. It's the first map, but for some reason, I'm doing it, I'm doing it last, so it's kind of backwards. But, I mean, it is what it is. Everything seems a little bit easier. Hey, how's it going? Everything seems a li little bit easier on the island, but I do like the caves better, man, for like the artifacts and stuff. Ah, oh, dude, I wish they would have done that quality on all the other maps for the artifact caves. That's kind of like half the fun of it, you know? And then you get to like Genesis where there is no artifact caves. It kind of sucks. Dude, I cannot see anything around here. Alright, so they should be around here. 
The new map? You talking about the one Lost Island? Because we'll be going there as soon as we're done with the island. Ah, here we go. Nice, nice. All the carrots. Go ahead and grab a bunch of these. And what's the spoil timer like on them? Yeah, very, very fast. That's all right. We won't need but a couple to tame them. We'll go ahead and pick a whole stack or so of them. That way there's plenty for them to spoil and go through. Yeah, I'm kind of excited because we got the new map and then... I think it's like three or four new creatures are supposed to be on it too. So that'll be kind of nice. I hope there's going to be a new boss. Kind of like how they did Crystal Isle. Where when it came out it's got its own specific boss and everything. It's kind of neat. It's got its own mechanics and all that too. I mean, I hated the Crystal Island boss, but still, it's pretty neat how they have their own thing. Yeah, I know, man. We're always hungry and thirsty. We're heading over to the water now. Let's calm down for a minute. Got some crazy colors on that. All right, let's get the canoe out. We'll head back over. Try to find us a horse. So this thing has got... I know it's used for meat, right? It ups the spoil timer. Does it do it for the carrots? Oh, it does. Oh, fantastic. Oh, dude, we're definitely going to do that then. Man, we do not need a preserving bin. Well, let's just do all that for right now. We don't need these. Let's repair this. Let's repair this. Have they said what mechanics are going to be with it yet? Like with the new creatures? I know there's an info page, I just haven't had time to look at it. Oh, and there's a berry. Stay over there, man. I don't want none. That'd be a pretty good team to get on this map soon, too, for the water. The Dinopithecus, is that the one? Is that the big ape? The new, uh, the new one? Yeah, it's a big monkey. Yeah, so, yeah, Genesis 2 is the last official map, and they're working on Arc 2, but they're still taking some of the player-made ones and kind of fixing them up and then making them not really official, but they're like, you know, like Ragnarok and Valgaro and stuff. Poop grenades? Seriously? Really? Aw, oh, dude. Is that the one that's supposed to destroy tech or something like that? Or disable tech? I know one of them has that weird... It's supposed to have a weird mechanic to it like that. Alright, so when we get up here, we'll hop out and then probably run around the backside if we can. I don't know for sure where the... the up area is. I usually have a thyla by the time I come over here and I just can kind of scale up the wall, you know? Yeah, so I know bet a lot of people will be going to Lost Island, get that stuff, and then head back to Genesis 2 because it's all like everything over there is tech, you know? For like the PvP maps or whatever. So the thing is... Ah, oh man, I have to pick this up. We're gonna... Well, I mean, it was good for the spoil timer for coming across the water. Oh, let's grab some while we're here. There we go. A little drink. And more of my wood, man. Boy, I tell you what. At least we got a bunch of that for now. Alright. Try to find us a horse. So I guess it goes in the last slot like usual. Those things always scare me. When they come by and holler when you're doing something. Is there one? Oh, yeah, they got the big, uh, the chally, or however you pronounce it. I forgot about those things. You gotta slip them a couple beers, and they'll throw stuff for you. I think it only throws rocks, though, whenever you tame it, right? I 
Due to figures, we got some carrots. And now there's gonna be no... No horses over here to tame. Alright, so what do we got up here? We got some raptors. Don't want to mess with them. Got some jerboas. Needed them earlier. Ah, there's one there. Too bad I don't have a spyglass. So we gotta sneak up and feed it one, right? There's another one over there, too. Dude, would you slow down? There's a bunch of them over here. Nice, nice. So 39%. Oh, man, that's a 145, too. Oh, dude. Well, that was a nice pick. <laughs> nice colors on it. That's why I went for it. Yeah, the Chalies are weird, man. I kind of like them, but they do, like, really low damage. Oh, you have to ride it first? Oh, you do. Okay. Nice, nice. 60% tamed. Dude, the raptors were this way. Turn around and go the other direction, please. There we go. There we go. Oh, man, that was nice. Kind of getting stuck on them. There's a cliff there. I'm just saying. Okay. Didn't know if you knew. <laughs> there we go. 86%. Nice. One more. I'd like it. Get stuck behind. Oh, okay. Thought he was going to get stuck back there. It would have worked out, you know. So we need what? Two more feedings? Maybe one? Oh, man, it's so nice that he's kind of stuck over in this corner. Well, not stuck, but he's kind of, like, over here. Yep, another cliff there, buddy. Awesome. Nice. Wait, blueprint lasso. Oh, that's for the... Hmm. Never mess with that. Well, there we go for that. I guess we can... We'll just feed him the rest of those. They're gonna go bad soon anyways. We'll use it for food as well. At least we have us a good team. So let's look at his stats a little bit. So he's uh, teamed out to be at a level 217. 1600 on the health. Stamina is 1700. His weight is 630. Damage is 420% and movement speed 120%. So not bad, man. Not bad. What about his inventory? There's nothing here for that. Let's grab a little bit of stuff while we're up here. Expand that a little bit. Oh, I gotta have the saddle on. I thought there was something weird with it. What do we need for a saddle? Must not have it unlocked. Oh, we do. Oh, it's a smithy item. We'll be building one of those soon. Let's get stuff together for that. And that's extremely simple to make. So we're going to need to find some metal and all that good stuff and get a forge going. Oh, they killed it. Nice. Let's get the hide from it. We're going to need that for the smithy and the forge. So isn't there something you can use... I thought you could use them for crafting something. Or is it just for the blueprint for the lasso? Oh, dude, I am sorry, man. Oh, my bad, dude. I, I apologize. My bad. I'll give you another carrot. How about that? There's a little bit more. <laughs> Smack him. It happens, man. It happens. It's a casualty. Take your horse down the old road, old town road. What? Yeah, the metal ingots. I'm gonna try to grab some metal real quick before we head back over. Grab a little bit of wood, stuff like that while we're over here. Let's put a little bit of this into 
I want to get his health up a little bit so we don't lose him right away. I mean, he is a 145 before we tamed him, so let's get some of the river rocks. That'll work. Try to get a mortar and pistol going here soon, too. All right, buddy, it's time to load you down, man. I got a bunch of wood. Oh, that's what it is. The saddle's a mortar. Okay, I knew there was something weird with them. Just can't remember what it was. So we won't have to do the mortar and pestle then. We'll just build the smithy and uh, the little forge and everything. Wanted to get river rocks. I think it's, what, five ingots we need? I know, buddy, I know. Have to check. We might be good here. I know he's about to get overweight. Yeah, we should be good. Cool. Yeah, he's getting a little bit heavy. Well, not too bad of a start. We got our little shack set up. We got us a nice little mount. I do want to get one of the fire wyverns off this map. Oh, dude. I like the fire ones a lot. I think it's deep enough. I hope it's deep enough. Nope. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> that is like so shallow, man. How is that not deeper? <laughs> yeah, he looks pretty cool. Yeah, I'll definitely probably get one of these instead of Parasaurus from now on. It seems like it's a pretty good team. This is the where I didn't want to go because of the Spinos. I didn't realize that their carry capacity and stuff was so high. Say, so, well, let's drop some of this meat and stuff. Try to get rid of a little bit of weight. Throw all those into him. Yeah, it didn't help out too much on his weight. I don't want to put any points into weight on him. I'd rather put it into other stuff since we'll be getting an Argentavis soon. And use that as our hauler. I think it's over here, right? Over here and down by the water. Is that where base is? So yeah, once we get done with the island map, which we're getting fairly close to it, we'll be doing modded series after that. And oh man, I can't wait to have S Plus back. And... Some of the other mods that just make it life a lot easier. It won't be too modded, just the quality of life stuff, you know. Thought we were down further. Yeah, I was gonna jump off, but I thought that was I don't know, man. I thought that was a lot deeper. <laughs> I thought it was Yeah, it's it's yeah, that was so shallow. I usually just jump off, you know, it's got that nice thing where unridden teams don't take damage. All right, so what do we need for this? Stone and wood. So there's that. It shouldn't take too long to get our our metal going. We'll put a little ramp or something out here. Dude, back up, man. Back up. Well, I tell you what, you trying to get inside. Let's build some stairs. We'll probably have two of these, so we'll put one there for now. Throw the metal in. And I would want to build another foundation out there to step up and down off of. You got some wood, buddy? You do? That's where it all went to? Nice, nice. There we go. 
Turn that up a little bit. Make it a little bit easier to see. We'll leave the canoe here for right now. We're not going to be venturing off too far. Keep that, and then... Wait, we got metal in here, too. And then for the smithy... I think we got everything. Let's run out and grab a little bit more wood while that metal's smelting up. See if we can get some river rocks down here. Oh, but never mind. There's some right here. Don't have to go far. Don't want to overdo it because as soon as we get that metal pick, it'll be a lot easier to get it. So nighttime should go by quite fast. Where's the clock at? There it is. Yeah, it won't take long at all. And I'd like to steal some of those eggs here soon. Probably won't do it in this video, but coming up soon, I want to go ahead and get one of those. And I know... I know on the far right side, where is it? Way over there, kind of in the jungle, up on that cliff, it's got the, like, the really, really high level ones. But I mean, that's quite the ride to get up there and do there are so many of them. The ones over here are kind of hit and miss whether they're going to be high level or not. Ah, we won't repair it. Calm down, dude. You'll be alright. Let's put that into... Put it into damage. We need to get some torches going. We got seven. Wait, do we need five? Or was it 10? Oh, we only need 5. Oh, we can do that now. You don't have anything in you. I think we need, what, hide still? 20 hide. Cool, so there's our smithy. Get four of those going so we can actually see. And this we're going to put right... Right here. And we can do another forge right there. To get some stuff smelted up a little bit quicker. We'll just put half in there for now. Kind of get us some charcoal going too. What time is it at my place? Right now it's about 7.30 p.m. I'm over on the west coast in the U.S. What time is it where you're at? Alright, so there's that. It's a little overkill on the lights, but like I said, I want to get some some charcoal going. Oh my gosh, it is so bright in here. Holy crap. I think we need that might be enough for a pick. Oh, it is nice. There's some hide, there's some wood. Let's go ahead and just put all this into there for right now. It's a nice storage, you know. And we're missing one more for that. Oh, okay. Hour behind, and then 9.34, so I guess it's in the morning over there in Thailand, right? Ah, oh, okay, gotcha. Yeah, that was the hard thing about doing the stream, is trying to get it set to where everybody, you know, it's kind of a good time for everybody. But I'll do one early morning in a day or two, and then that'll kind of cover the people that would be sleeping right now. drop this stuff real quick cool let's grab a little bit more metal to get that going and then we're kind of set we're not doing too bad
There we go. Turn our lights up a little bit. Should be morning here soon. Oh yeah, it's coming up on morning time now. That's what I like, the quick nights. Except for on Aberration, and it's kind of like always dark, you know? Ah, uh, mountain time, yeah. Middle of the states, or middle of the world. Not necessarily the states. How are we looking? 30? Yeah, I like Genesis 2. I wanted to spend more time there, but man, it was I was having extreme lag. I was having a lot of problems with the whole mission system. Everything kept resetting. It was... Ah, oh man, they, they needed to work on it a little bit more. I love the patterns on the R creatures, the R versions. And I was wanting to try to tame a Noggin, but dude, I've re read about so many problems, and I was trying to watch some other videos like uh, Syntac, and then uh, Nublix had some issues too. It's just I don't want to... I didn't want to even try to mess with it. It's already a hard enough team as it is, let alone with them glitching out. Hopefully they get a fix. I'd like to go back sometime. But I wasn't wasn't a fan of the missions at all. That's why I didn't stick around Genesis 1 when it came around. Well, I mean, there was a lot of issues with it too, but I just didn't like the whole mission system. So we need to get a saddle for this dude so we can use a mortar and pestle. I need to make up some spark powder. So we just need a fiber or some fiber hide and wood. Dude, that is a lot of stuff for that. Alright, let's go grab. We're gonna have to take him out to get some wood. It's kind of too far just to run. Okay, good, good, good. Hey, glad it works out for a lot of people at the time. I kind of have an open schedule, so it doesn't really matter what time for me. As long as it's not like in the middle of the day. So either early morning or evening time. Dude, these trees. Give me the wood, man. There we go. <laughs> the whole tiny bit that we got. Put that into health. We'll get him up around 4,000 on the health. Yeah, see, I never messed with the Feroxes until Genesis 2. On Genesis 1, I didn't... I had a lot of problems. I kept crashing every time I was trying to change biomes. With the whole teleporting thing. So I didn't get to look around much. I think I went to the snow biome. And set up a little base there. And then, you know, started off in the bog. And I tried... Taming one of the Bloodstalkers, and man, dude, it took forever to get all of the little blood packets you need. And then it bugged out and wouldn't let me tame it, so... <laughs> it was... Oh, dude, that was such a waste of time on that. Right, I think we're good on wood. And you're gonna be overweight. That's alright, we'll go on foot. I'll grab some fiber on the way back. What dino am I going to use on the dragon? You mean for grabbing the eggs, or you mean with the dragon boss? Oh, dude, I was, like, not paying attention where I was going. <laughs> Sound like he fell. Oh, the boss, I have no idea. It was kind of last minute, uh, planning this whole thing out with the stream, so I haven't thought about it. I think the first time I did it, I used... I think it was Theories. For one version of it, and then I used Terra Birds, and I can't remember what the other thing was that I used. The Terra Birds were, uh, that was an interesting one. They were extremely, extremely loud. Oh, I think it was Spinos. I used Terra Birds, and uh, Theries, and Spinos. But on this one, I don't know. It depends on whatever you guys want to do. We can, uh, we can tame up whatever we're, you guys want to. I like using weird stuff. I like using stuff that people usually don't use. I mean, if you watch some of my other boss fights on videos, you'll kind of see that. I use, like, Sarko's on the island boss, and then I used um, a whole bunch of weird different things on, like, Crystal Isles and stuff. Kind of changes it up, you know? So let's see. I think that's enough on the fiber. Let's start heading back. 
coming, buddy? You get stuck in the trike? Yeah, the teleporting, I crashed almost every single time trying to go in between. And what I was trying to do was make the bog my, like, main base. And then set out little outposts while I was in the other biomes. And then, you know, keep everything back in the bog. So transferring in between when it was crashing all the time. Oh, man, it just... It was not good. Alright, let's grab some water. And then we'll grab everything out of him. And make a saddle. I want water, not the stone, please. Let's put some into damage. Yeah, I know. All happy, huh, buddy? What are we missing? Hide? Really? Let's eat some of these berries, get them out of our inventory. I need to build a preserving bin as well. Try to keep some stuff here soon. Some meats and all that. Just throw those into here. I don't think we have enough stuff to build one. I want to get that saddle done before anything. Yeah, Rockwell's Garden. Oh, dude, I had a problem. I don't remember if I recorded it or I just dealt with it in between recordings. So the summoners. Dude, I had a problem where the summoners... Oh, man, I had... I counted uh, upwards of like 170 of them had spawned. And they just... They weren't going away. I would kill them and they kept coming back. So that was... Yeah, that was a- that was a thing. That's one thing that was causing a lot of my lag, I think, was that. And it was, like, hard because I was trying to go down there and get the... Get the, uh, Reapers tamed up and all that. Tell you what. I think I'm gonna leave you at base. I just wanna run around and grab... A little bit of hide. I use a bow and arrow and the bolas. Alright, just hang tight there, man. Take out the Parasaurs, that'll give us enough hide for making more bolas anyway. Let's get rid of these spears. 24 damage? Oh my gosh. Yep, I think the bowl is gonna break before he dies. <laughs> Such low damage. There we go. Yeah, we can try that. I would definitely like to try the sabers. Um, I don't think I've taken those into a boss fight. I've been wanting to. And that's one of my also my favorite teams. So, dude, I'm all for doing sabers. Definitely taking a UD for a little bit of a boost too, you know. And I think since the last time I was here, they patched it to where the mana core actually lands. It's not that hard to get it to land anymore. You mean if they're tamed, they can't jump, or when they're wild? Because I didn't mess with mine too much whenever I tamed them on Genesis. Or Genesis 2, I mean, you know. Alright, are we good on hide, almost? Grab a little bit more. Is there one more around? Oh, actually, that's all my bolas. Let's head back. That should be enough to be able to build a saddle for the horse. And we'll see where we're going to go from there. The R ones can jump, just doesn't seem like they jump that far. Is that what you're saying? Because I know I had problems getting up onto my platform on Genesis 2. With, uh, whenever I jumped down. It was, I mean, it's a fairly high cliff I was on, but it was... Yeah, it seemed like he wasn't getting that much height. Are you kidding me? Holy crap, that's a lot of hide. 
Yeah, we can do those too. I haven't I haven't used those at all for the boss fights, the feather raptors, you know. Probably should have made some bolas. It's alright, buddy. You'll have to stop running sometime. Almost out of arrows. There you go. Run back this way. Not sure how that missed. Dude, he like scaled that like nothing. Holy crap. I thought I, <laughs> I, thought I had him kind of closed in. Oh, they can't jump at all for you? Hmm. Wonder if it's bugged. Cause mine mine could jump. It just didn't seem to go as far. Where'd you go, man? Oh, you're right there? Holy crap, you scared the crap out of me. Don't go swimming. There's worse stuff in the water than up here. And I don't want to go after you. Please. Great, I'm out. It's alright. Spears it is. Yep, I see that Meg. <laughs> He's gonna get us. Oh, nice. Watch, we'll run out of stamina. And this is where we'll end up dying. We got three of the arrows back. Not much. Yeah, that's the thing about Ark. Man, I really hope on Ark 2 they get it sorted out with a lot of the bugs and stuff. New, uh, new platform. I don't know if it's a new game engine that they're using. But they're, like, backed by Microsoft, I think, now, right? So that should help out with their development, I would think. Oh, on the island. I'm sorry. I got you all twisted around. Uh, we're gonna be using aloes on the island. I thought you meant for the boss fight here for the dragon and stuff. Yeah, we'll be using aloes. I'm hoping. That's kind of the plan, is to try aloes out. And if those don't work too well, then the fallback will be fairies. And we're going to start taming those here soon. Uh, I don't want to give any spoilers, but there's been some recent issues with the current boss that we're fighting. <laughs> It'll be up on the channel here soon. Alright, so there's this. Should be able to get some spark powder. How are we doing? We got 40 of that. Nice. So what is that for? Is that just for, like, leading him around? Or can we actually rope other creatures? Nah, it's all good, man. It's, it's like the same bosses on some of the maps. Yeah, it got me kind of twisted around. Ah, what's up, Dan? Hey, man, I appreciate the donation there. Much appreciated. Silver Beans, I have not seen you in a long time. Oh, so it's going to be on the Unreal 5. Well, that'll be good. I think I've got most of the bugs worked out with that platform, so... Having Ark on that, it should run good on everything. Alright, so let's see. Where are we at now? We've got him. I need to get some spark powder going. And then I'd like to get a little bit more metal going. And then I'm wanting to try to get an Argentavis or a Pterodon soon. What should we do first? The Argentavis? Because the Pterodon Saddle, I think we need Chitin for, right? Yeah, we're going to need Chitin for that one. Oh, we need it for that too. Hmm. 
Maybe we should take a trip up into the snow biome. Oh, yeah, it happens, man. Yeah, I wonder how much Vin Diesel's gonna be playing into Ark 2. Apparently he plays actual Ark quite a bit, from what I've I've gathered. So I mean that's kind of a neat thing. Wouldn't really think that, but I mean it's kind of cool. Let's make some more arrows before we head out, just in case. What are we missing? Thatch? Thatch and fiber. Repair that as well. Yeah, so it's supposed to pick up for Arc 2, kind of where Genesis 2 left off. If you saw the end trailer, like whenever you beat Rockwell and everything, it's supposed to pick up right after that, so it's. Yeah, I don't know. I'm hoping it's not going to be too much tech stuff. I'm hoping it's going to be more along the lines of kind of like Primitive Arc. I'm kind of guessing it's not, though. See, let's venture out up here a little bit. I was wanting to go to the snow biome so we can get some chitin and everything up there, start scouting out for an Argentavis. But let's head this way. I think there's some stuff up here we can get chitin from easily. I don't know where the scorpions are on this map. And then we'll kind of try to scout out for maybe one of the, uh, little feather raptor eggs. I think we can go... There's one of them, I think it's up this way? Where it drops down into that little gully? Oh, there's a drop! Let's see what's in there. Watch, it'll disappear as soon as we get up to it. Oh, it's a raptor. Back up, man. Uh-huh. Getting sleepy, ain't you? I'll tell you what. Flamethrower, not interested in it. We're not going to need that. We'll take that. Uh, We'll just take it. It's a blueprint. It's easy. I think we have that unlocked, though. Drop the rest of this stuff. There we go. Where's he at? Oh, he's right there. Back up, man. <laughs> Dude, it kills him so quick. Not kills him, but knocks him out, you know? It's alright, we'll get his hide. Nice, nice. So, Silver Beans, are you going to be doing any videos? Are you still going to pick that up again? Dude, where's that area that goes down? I'm thinking it's right over there. Maybe we need to go up a little bit further? I don't know, I'm lost. Turned around. I think we need to go back and go up a level. Or I might be able to get up right here. Or is that just a waterfall? Ah, just a waterfall. Well, I tell you what. Yeah, I've seen some of your stuff too, Croc. You don't do live streams though, do you? A little bit better than the, uh, <laughs> the water one. Oh, we're stuck. There we go. 
Dude, he was like stuck in the ground. Let's right, see if we can get up here and go down, go a little bit higher, and then go down in that gully and maybe grab us some eggs. I got you. Yeah, I was real, I was real kind of not wanting to do any of the the streaming myself. I don't know. It's just a lot different. It's kind of relaxing doing the videos because you can edit them and all that good stuff. Yeah, the thing, that's the thing too, is uh, going from recording to the streaming, it, man, everything's like so different. Is that another one on me? Oh, that's my Jerboa. Yeah, I got you, man. Yeah, you gotta take it easy. Pace yourself out. Alright, so this is where I thought we were earlier, and there should be a way down, is it right over here? Right there? Or right here? One of these two. Should drop down in. Nope, it just loops around. Boy, I tell you what. There's gotta be a nest around here somewhere. There's too many of these things that not have a nest. I need to watch my health on the on the horse. Nope, not up here. Oh my gosh, it's a whole bunch of them. Dude, they're stuck. That's a good thing. Yep, nope, nope, nope. Not messing with that right now. <laughs> Where's our nest at though is the thing. My favorite arc map is Aberration, and then the map that I hate the most, it's also Aberration. <laughs> I mean, that's how it is with that map, right? I think it's my favorite one because of all the colors with the lights and everything, different biomes. I'm not too crazy about the boss fight. That's probably the worst boss fight for me. It was Rockwell. I think that's the only one so far that I stopped on the Gamma one and didn't go any further. So down there... Is where we're heading. <gasps> oh, dude. Thought we were going to get separated. That'd be horrible right now. Alright, so I know for sure there's nests down here. That's the walkway I was trying to find for the past 10 minutes. I just don't know if the nests have spawned in is a thing, because these are usually full down here of creatures. Yep, there's a bunch there. So I'm kind of worried if we get into a big pack of them, not being able to... Oh, he doesn't eat these. He doesn't eat meat. That's right. I can't force feed them because I don't have... I don't have any of the cakes. Alright, let's just do it. We'll be alright. We might be all right. This might be it. Oh, dude. Yep. They're not getting knocked out as quick as I thought. All right. Let's kill them off real quick. Wait, have I got more arrows? I do. Get all these killed off so they don't come back. I don't know how their torpor is. I should look at one of them. Oh, it says right there. Oh, it goes down fast, doesn't it? Oh, that's our health. Never mind. Never mind. We should be set on hide here now. Wait, is that? Is that the last one? That's a level 135. Oh, man. Our horse is in very bad shape. He definitely needs to take it easy 
and heal up a little bit. Do they take reduced damage or something? I mean, that's not doing very much on... on hitting them. With the bone arrow, you know? Sorry, he's about dead. There we go. Thank you. I appreciate your donations. Nice, nice. Cool. So let's find their nest. Try to get us some eggs. Get out of here. And there's another pack of them. Or is it just one? Yep. Ah, I don't run! Is that him? That's him. Alright, where's your nest at? Yeah, I try not to lose a horse. I'm stuck, though. I was trying to come down here and find an egg or two. Oh, we're not going that way. We'll lose it for sure. Yeah, I don't see any nests. Ah, oh, man. Dude, that sucks. They're usually right over here by the water. Put that into stamina. He was running out pretty bad there. <laughs> Nothing. Boy, I tell you what, that was a total waste there. Buddy, all right? You look a little stuck there. Either that or he's in shock. <laughs> One or the other. Well, that kind of run down there was a bust. I need to get a meat ear eater for uh, doing runs like that. Oh, there's a Rex. Dude, I need to find some crystals so I can build a spyglass. Does anybody know if there's crystal around here? Try to cut across to the other side over there. Man, yeah, I tell you what. I think what we're going to do for grabbing the eggs is use a pterodon. That way I can drag them off, drop in, pick up the eggs, and get out of there. That's how I usually do it. Get this horse back to base. He is doing pretty bad. I right, should definitely check the map out if you have time. It's a free map. And, dude, it's it's pretty nice. They kind of got different areas, and then there's a huge underwater kind of cave. And then there's the underwater, or not underwater, but the underground kind of aberration area. So, I mean, there's tons of stuff here. And then the boss for it is actually three bosses in one. Get a little bit of stamina back. That way we can run if we need to. I think we'll just run up here and jump right off the cliff. Another good thing about this map is there are sheep everywhere for taming. Hey, glad that you could stop by, man. Enjoy your dinner. <laughs> You're a BMO follower? Oh, dude, don't die, please. That was meaning for me or it. Well, we made it back to base. So we got a, got quite a bit done today. We've got the horse. Very good team. He's just three quarters of the way dead. We got our little shack set up. I think what I want to do is try to get the pterodon, try to grab some feather raptor eggs, and then go from there, try to do some scouting. I do want to go over and get a thyla here pretty soon. But we got to get up all the kind of narcotics and everything made for that. Glad you're enjoying the stream. We are going to be ending it here pretty soon. However, let's get a little bit of stuff put away first and sort it out. 
make a preserving bin real quick before we go. That's what I was trying to get all the uh, spark powder for, too. Wait, has he got it in him? I think he's still got it in here being made. Yep, there we go. There's some there. What are we missing? Fiber. Boy, I tell you what. I'm having a lot of issues with fiber lately. A boss on Lost Island? I have no idea what it would even be. I'm kind of hoping it'd be like a new one. Something that they haven't done yet. Just to kind of keep it different. I don't like when they reuse the same boss over and over. I mean, I see why they do, but at the same time, it's like... It's kind of nice when there's a different one. Need my arrows back, please. Well, hope everybody enjoyed the stream. We are going to go ahead and end this one here. We'll probably have another one here soon. I want to do one, like I said, early in the morning. My time for everybody else that's on the other side of the world and that couldn't make it. So I'll definitely keep it posted online. And then, like I said, we got quite a few series going on the channel. We got Subnautica just started. We got Seven Days to Die. And then we got the Ark one going as well. But I appreciate everybody showing up. And we're going to go ahead and leave this one here. Hope you enjoyed the video. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.